Uh, I mean, the, the thing you're working on now with the new record, how involved are you in, in writing songs for that? Like, how, how do you do it? Uh, pretty involved. You know, th this one's a little different because we started during the pandemic. So um, we started kind of conceiving of things uh, long distance, just kind of trying to talk out what we wanted to to say and and, and write about. And uh, and then we kind of everybody kind of contributed from afar until we were able to get together uh, last summer and then a little bit in the fall and winter as well, too. So um, it, it, this one is a little more intentional that way. Um, uh, oftentimes things happen a little more spontaneously, but we kind of had to plan it out just to make sure everybody was, you know, because we couldn't be together, basically. So Yeah, yeah. Also, it was a lot of sending files back and forth. A lot of that, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How was that experience then? Uh, it, you know, it's good. It's just a different way of working. And, uh, it, it, you know, it kind of got us out of our comfort zone. Uh, and, and you have to be very intentional about it. And you have to kind of, you, you can't, when you're not together, it, you, you have to be very direct. Uh, you can't kind of just have things happen spontaneously, you know. Mm -hmm. uh, but it was, it was fun. It was good. It was a good exercise. But so what, what do you mainly write on? Because I know you play guitar. You said you, you play some bass. But what do you have a main instrument or is it? Uh, it's usually guitar uh, because I'm not very good at it. Um, and so it's it's a good tool to kind of get get out of my head um, because I'm, I don't have a lot of facility with it, if, if that makes right. sense. Uh, kind of gets me out of my comfort zone. Occasionally I'll write on a piano, but but usually it's it's guitar. Right. What got you into to picking the guitar as as an instrument? Having, I mean, was it because you were into bass or? Uh, yeah, you know, I, I didn't. I mean, I always messed around with guitar a little bit, but I, I didn't really have one. Uh, Derek actually gave me a guitar about sixteen or seventeen years ago, and um, he ended up going on tour with um, Eric Clapton, and um, and so we were kind of on hiatus for about a year, and I was like, well. I guess I should learn how to use this thing. <laughs> so I, that was that was kind of my guitar year. I kind of found my way around it and uh, and realized I could use it as a as a tool to do some writing too. So I'm grateful for that. Yeah, yeah, perfect, man. But so was it like when you played in the Derek Trucks band? Was it mainly uh, Derek bringing you pieces of music that you wrote vocals to, or was it? <laughs> well, yeah, mostly. Uh, Kofi did a lot of the writing. Um, and then a lot of material would come from just messing around during sound checks and just jamming, um, yeah, and, cool. and just re remembering stuff, you know, just kind of group improvisation. Um, but yeah, that, that was mostly how it, and then I would, I, I contributed quite a few lyrics and stuff like that. Right, right, right. Yeah. Because you mentioned, you know, uh, improvisation and, 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 uh, jamming and stuff. So. When I've seen you guys, and also just hearing your records and stuff, the whole band is in is so in tune with what with what's going on. Like, is is that is that um, rehearsed? I don't think it's rehearsed before, but are there any obvious cues that are decided beforehand, or is it just that everyone uh, is just so in tune with what's going on? Uh, well, you know, because it is kind of improvisatory or improvisation based. You just you have to be paying attention. Like you have to be in the moment um and and then uh, we don't really have a lot of planned out things but over the years you kind of pick up on on derek's body language so you kind of know oh, yeah. what's going on um but yeah you got to have a lot of eye contact and and you can't just you can't just start daydreaming because you never know what's going to happen you got to be <laughs> you got to be in it yeah yeah that is that, that, that's something you guys do extremely well oh really thank you Cool. So what's I mean, what's uh, Derek's body language? Because I mean, obviously he, he's that's also the very um, uh, fascinating thing about Derek is he's he's very calm person on stage, but everything is happening through the guitar. Mm -hmm. So being an audience member, I've never seen what's his what's the cues he's looking for. Like uh, he's just looking back, or yeah, it's pretty subtle. It's like it could be a head nod, it could be uh, a little tip of the guitar neck and uh you know or or a, or a shake of the head or a nod of the head or you know it's it's pretty subtle but i've 
That's, that's funny. I've never really defined it. I just kind of know. I know it when I see it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's the best way, I guess. <laughs> yeah.